Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Chow Vin Sung. Welcome to our Healthy Eyes, Healthy Life series. Today, I'm going to tell you about conjunctivitis. Conjunctivitis is also called pink eye. The conjunctiva is the outer layer on the white part of the eye. Small blood vessels are found in the conjunctiva and these can become dilated and inflamed, giving rise to the appearance of a red or pink eye. This condition is called conjunctivitis. Conjunctivitis is a very common condition. It results in red, itchy, sticky or watery eyes. The eyes will feel gritty and uncomfortable. The eyelids may be swollen and there may be eye discharge. Usually, the vision remains good or is only mildly affected and there should not be much pain. Conjunctivitis is usually caused by infection or allergies. Most cases of infective conjunctivitis are caused by the same organisms that cause common colds and coughs. Viral conjunctivitis is the most common cause of infectious conjunctivitis, followed by bacterial conjunctivitis. Even the COVID-19 virus can cause conjunctivitis. Infective conjunctivitis is usually mild and self-resolving. Sometimes, the symptoms may last a couple of weeks Conjunctivitis is very contagious and it is important to prevent transmission to other family members by practicing good hygiene. Wash your hands frequently, avoid touching your eyes and do not share towels, eye drops, pillows and cosmetics with your family members. Stop using contact lenses until the conjunctivitis has settled. Lubricating eye drops will help to reduce the eye discomfort and wash away the discharge. Your eye doctor may prescribe you antibiotic eye drops or mild steroid eye drops to hasten the recovery. Allergies can also cause conjunctivitis. Pollen, cigarette smoke, animal fur, and dust mites are examples of allergens that can cause allergic conjunctivitis. Lubricating eye drops as well as antihistamine eye drops will relieve the itchiness associated with allergic conjunctivitis. Severe cases may require a short course of topical steroid eye drops, but these would need to be used under the close supervision of your eye doctor. If there is significant pain or if there is copious discharge, blurred vision, extreme sensitivity to light, headache or vomiting associated with red eyes, it may not be common conjunctivitis. Please see your eye doctor as soon as possible to make sure that you do not have a more serious eye condition. I hope that you enjoyed this video about conjunctivitis. Please subscribe to our channel to learn more about other important eye conditions. Till then, I wish you healthy eyes and a healthy life.